does religion kick in and you, know, you say, okay, that's important to me now to speak about religion? Religions, you know, they're all about the materiality and territory and who belongs to what and, you know, identity, but they're not really about faith. Yeah. You know, and so everything has been sort of pushed into this logical structure and this materiality. Yeah. So you kind of sort of feel the absence of philosophy. You yeah. also feel its absence in education. You feel the absence of anything abstract. Mm -hmm. And I guess for me, as somebody of mixed background, realizing that the world isn't really divided into all these things that it's supposed to be divided, and that it's actually a lot more hybrid. One example is I have an Armenian friend whose family is from Western Turkey and in 1915 his family moved to Cyprus and so he grew up with his grandmother who's an Orthodox Armenian kneeling on a car prayer rug with her hands open and it wasn't until he was an adult in London that he realized that's not how Orthodox Armenians pray. That is, she had a habit which had, was conditioned by living in a Muslim-dominated environment, which she brought with her because that's how she prayed. It doesn't make her any less Armenian Orthodox. It means that her physical conditioning was part of a different community. I want to see the hybridity in the world. I want to see where people are coming together because this space in which everybody has to pick a team and stick to it it just doesn't seem to be working.